Hey neighbor, so today we're going to talk about averages. Now you may or may not know, I'm actually a programmer, but I do have a degree in science. In particular, one of my majors is applied mathematics. Now it may also surprise you that I've never actually taken a course in probability or statistics, but I did take quite a lot of courses in abstract mathematics, which is strange considering that my major is applied mathematics. Hmm. So averages. What I want you to take note is you shouldn't just take averages as the only number to take note of. Let's say someone tells you that the average height is 173.4 centimeters. Yes, I'm using centimeters. And let's say your height is 175 centimeters, which is about 5 foot 9 inch in case you're not using the metric system. So before we go into further detail, let's talk about average. When they say average, what they really mean is the mean. Uh, in particular, the arithmetic mean, because there are other means such as the geometric mean and the harmonic mean. So the arithmetic mean simply takes all the values, add them up, and divide it by the number of samples. While the arithmetic mean is often used to report central tendencies, it is not a robust statistic, meaning that it is greatly influenced by outliers. Now you should know at least two other statistics measurements. One of them is called the median. The median is the center value that separates the higher half and the lower half of the sample. Now the other one is called the mode, which is the most frequently occurring value in the sample. Now I'm going to contrive an example for you, just to show how it might be misleading to rely on just the arithmetic mean. And I'm going to use the word average because it's very hard to say arithmetic mean all the time. So let's say the sample consists of five values, which is ridiculous. So the samples consist of 160 centimeters, 161, 180, 183, and 183. Now, if you add them all up and divide it by 5, you get 173.4 centimeters. You are elated because you are 175 centimeters, which is above average height. Take note though, if you look at the median, the median is 180 centimeters, which separates the higher half and the lower half. What this means is that half of the sample is actually taller than you. Even the median is taller than you, which kind of sucks. When we look at the mode, the most frequently occurring value is 183 centimeters, which is ridiculously higher than you. So I hope that you gain a greater understanding of why it might be insufficient to rely on just the average. If someone just tells you that, that's all I have, and I'll see you next time. Oh wait, I'm going to show you something. Meet tetrahedron and cube.